everyone. I want to explain why I'm posting a video not on a Saturday. And it's because I wanted to get some more content on my channel and not just have like such little amount of videos like when I'm just starting out. So I just want to add some extra content and I'm in like I'm at Lake Tahoe anyways. So it just makes sense to me to get some video content for my channel. Here's me. It's one of the first times I've hiked by myself. It's a little unnerving. I'm technically in Nevada right now hiking to Lake Tahoe. You can probably hear the sound of my shoes crunching on the pine needles. I'm not gonna lie, I just wonder every moment, could there be an animal like near me? some kind of predatory animal, who knows. But there was a lot of cars out today, so with more people, there's less animals. I wonder if I can check my navigation while it's filled. Okay. I just checked my navigation and I'm heading to the right place. That's so cool, like that lighting. I'm like within steps of the lake. I finally saw some people. And the creek is down there, Marlette Creek. I don't know if you can see the lake. It just looks pale, but it's right there. Right there is the lake. This is the kind of stuff that I feel like really helps heal us, like going out in nature. I guess like by my by yourself is kind of ideal, even though it's not like the safest. But for me, when I'm by myself, it just adds a whole nother layer of, well actually like many layers, many layers of just like introspection. Here I am on the bridge again. Make sure I don't fall off. Just sitting on the shore of Lake Tahoe. I wanted to sit here because these gravelly things on the shore were really captivating to me. You might hear people's voices in the background. 
just a lot of people out hiking. Okay. I'm headed back to my car. I have a lot of faith in myself that I'll find my car. But, I mean, yeah. What I mean to say is find the road. And hopefully it's the right part of the road where my car is. It's like that time of the hike where everything is so beautiful. But at the same time, I just want to be safe in my car. It's about an hour or two before sunset. Sounds like I'm in some kind of suspense movie. I'm actually pretty, pretty good at navigating. I remember that tree stump. I get like intuition about things, which way to go, that kind of stuff. I remember this tree too. talk more about the sign of stuff right when I found the Sarno books I did like at the exact same time I was becoming more connected with nature And it wasn't such a hard leap from that to the Sarno methods because all, like one of his main things is taking care of yourself like emotionally and like taking care of your soul basically. And then, and then having faith that the physical part will follow like your, your physical form will be in good health if you're always paying attention to your emotional needs and your intuition. I mean, there's moments where I get a little of the old pain when my life gets stressful and and then I just slow down my thoughts focus them more on oh like what did I learn from Sarno and all of that to address this so I might journal a little like even just journaling with your finger like in the sand it works. And then, I kid you not, the, the pain kind of lifts away. I made it. I made it to my car. I knew I could do it. I want to thank everyone for watching and please feel free to subscribe if you want to see more content and I'm going to include all the affiliate links from my other videos for the recommended books and my camera equipment. I will see you next time. Thanks everyone.